growing up uh, from Michigan, I, I always watched the Wolverines play. So you know, I used to watch the NCAA championship game growing up, and that was a goal I had. You know, growing up, I wanted to play college hockey, and I wanted to win an NCAA title. Um, you know, they had the game on ESPN. It was just all the glory. You're like, oh, it'd be so cool one day to be a part of that. And uh, I got lucky. I got put put in. Uh, um, you know, position uh, to go to Denver. Odd man, three on two, shot way out to make the save as Menino. Fires the save, Menino. Rebound was in the slot, taken away. Menino's a little bit upset as he talks to John Campion, and the referee. Let's take a look. Peter Menino is known for getting upset when anyone is even near him. So when someone knocks his helmet off, he's going to be that much more upset. Wilton are known for really protecting his crease. Uh, they won it the year before going in, so there's a lot of added pressure to our team in general, knowing that we were the defending champions. And uh, we had a lot of seniors that had won it and kind of paced, paced us through the year. We got hot at the right time, and um, I mean, the celebration, everything, just the, the camaraderie of the team was unbelievable. I, I think that's the biggest thing. Everybody says that when you win a championship, you have to have a special kind of thing within your team. We had that, everybody was close, and the leadership was in place. Um, but it was great. Parents were there. Everybody's parents. You know, you you get to hold that like wooden trophy, and it's just like you've accomplished one thing that you, you looked at when you're younger, and it's a fulfilling thing. It, it, it was really great, and um, you know, I want to share that with uh, my family for the rest of my life. Starting in goal for the Wolves, number 33, Peter. I always say, and it's the truth, is pro, is, pro hockey is different than college and junior hockey. Uh, anything can happen at any time, and you really have to, you just kind of have to let it happen. The, the sport of hockey, I guess any pro sport is, is what have you done for me lately? You know, you, you could play a, a great run of games, 10, 12 games, and you lose one. Well, you just lost, and that's the feeling you have, this bitter feeling of losing that game. So I think you just try and draw from that as, hey, you can win as much as you want, but you can lose that last game and, and you know, you're not happy, everybody's not happy. So you just, I think the biggest thing is just try and win as much as you can. Leave it up, tough end of a big stop by Benito. Stay, stay in check with yourself, knowing uh, the capability of what you can do and, and always knowing that that can, that can come out. Even if you're not playing, beginning of the year, uh, Manny Legacy is here and, you know, I didn't play for quite a while, uh, but but I just stayed stayed focused. I had fun. You know, I was out in practice a lot, um, working on little things. Got back in, started playing a little bit, felt good. You know, hit hit a road bump here and there, and um, you know, Mac played great. Mac's still playing great. It's just it's the way it is. There's always good goalies at this level, and and, and they push you. You push each other, and um, I, I you know I don't feel like anything. It's just another day, really. I. I uh, I want to come and win, just like any guy in the locker room does. I want to win with the guys, for the organization, and, uh, and hopefully we have the ultimate success in the end, a championship.